The borrower is servant to the lender. Proverbs 22, seven. Maybe you're feeling that debt has a hold of you. Okay, I have this image of this elephant. I was told as a kid that the way they keep those little, those big elephants at the circus, like under wraps, is when they're babies, they put a rope around their feet um, and they put a peg in the ground. And these little baby elephants, when they pull on this rope, it's at the point where they're not quite strong enough to rip it out of the ground. And they just learn that when this rope is around my foot, I'm helpless against it. I just stay here. And then they stop fighting against it. And then when these giant elephants, you know, when they grow to these giant elephants, the circus people can still put these ropes around these elephants and put a peg in the ground. And these giant elephants will stay put because they have been, in their brain, they've been told, you cannot get past this. This is just the way it is. It's stronger than you. Just, you know, stay here. This is how debt can be with people. Uh, one of the biggest things that people envy about their neighbors, we like to say it's their cars. We like to say it's their houses. We like to say it's their hot wives, whatever it is. The reality is the thing that people uh, envy the most about their neighbors is their debt-free life. It's something that everybody wants, but they feel like it's impossible for them. They feel like it's great for rich people to be out of debt, but they themselves are never going to experience it. We just may as well suck it up and have payments the rest of our lives. Okay. We are elephants. We are giant elephants with a little tiny rope around us. It is uncomfortable to get out of. Yes, it is uncomfortable. You have to make some sacrifices. Maybe not the sacrifices you think you're going to make. Okay. I don't believe in living on beans and rice so that you can get out of debt in two months. I, I just, I don't believe in that. Um, but I do believe that you are a servant to your debt. Your debt will own you and it's keeping you from all the wonderful things you could do with your money, with your time, with your energy. Um, I would love to show you another way of living. I would love to help you. If you're ready to bust those chains and get out and live life differently, I would love to help you. And possibly my 12-week Money Master group coaching course is a resource for you.